So I'm with Per Nielsen from, I don't know, what, what should I say, from Meshuga, from Scar Symmetry. And Nocturnal Rights. Oh, for how many bands are and you? And Kaipa. Eh? Lately you've been touring a lot with Meshuga. Yeah, yeah, I have. You know, I've been a fan for many years. I've seen them live like 10 times. Mm. And uh, then one, of the, one day out of the blue I got a text from Thomas like, mm -hmm. hey man, would you consider doing a tour with us? And Oh, and no then, casting, just... We want you. Yeah, yeah. I'm not surprised. So, well, I was surprised, <laughs> but um, no, it was really cool. So I, I w went down to Stockholm to their studio rehearsal mm -hmm. space, and uh, we, we jammed for a bit. And they were like, "Oh, let's do it." Wow, so that's it wasn't even like a proper audition or anything. It's just like, yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's let's just awesome. Then. So you've been touring. You told me just nearly two years now or two yeah, years yeah coming on two years wow so it must be a little bit different than touring with scar symmetry or because there is so much love for that i mean yeah, people I mean, love scar symmetry i do you know i love uh, yeah, scar yeah. symmetry but i mean mashuga is, is something else it's a different scale yeah you know? it's like it's a much bigger band what about your your own project i mean scar symmetry when do we see something happening well pretty soon uh, and People will uh, like get uh, me for saying that because I've, <laughs> I've said that for a couple okay. of years. You know? <laughs> like the previous album, we released that in 2014. Mm -hmm. I took some time off and then I wrote the, the, the album we're working on now. So I, I wrote that actually a couple of years ago. Recorded drums, recorded all the lead vocals. That's been done for like two years. And uh, so now I just finished uh, like all the rhythm guitars are done. So we just have solos and keyboards finish up and then mm. gonna mix it and it'll, it'll be done so I remember you have a torpedo live right yeah why were you attracted to that, to that kind of technology because I have a couple of amps and uh, I don't want to crank cramp crank them through a cab uh, in my studio I have a little studio set up uh, but it's not treated the way I would like to record mm. high-gain guitars uh, so then the two notes torpedo is like a per perfect thing, you know. I, I can't remember you were telling me that you've been using maybe not Low Live or another one on the latest Scar Symmetry album. Yeah, you yeah. recorded the guitars that way. Um, well, I recorded the guitars actually DI straight okay. into, the, into into the audio interface. Then I brought the DI, went over to Ola England. Mm -hmm. So I had Ola and then Jokes Skog. Okay. Uh, they helped me out and we reamped. So we okay. We used a couple of Olas, uh, his his, uh, his signature amp, and we used an mm -hmm. old uh, like rectifier. Uh, so we did two takes of, of reamping, and uh, we went through Olas uh, torpedo. Yeah. And you know, for the new Scar Simple album, I'm doing seven tracks. Uh, Wait a minute. Yeah. yeah. Three, three, one. What's the deal? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Because usually, like um, all the, all the Scar Symmetry albums are four tracks of yeah of rhythm, and I'm like, this this new album is is more it's heavier and more brutal. That sounds like things everyone say. Yeah. Always, but, <laughs> oh, not always. Oh, no, it's actually. more melodic, it's more heavy, it's yeah. more brutal. It's more pop. Yeah. I wanna go with a country vibe. Yeah. No, not you, not this time. But this one. Since since we're doing a trilogy and this is the second part, mm. uh, if I feel like then I can explore, and you know, I can go into that direction more than if it would you have just had been another album. So since like it's gonna be connected as a trilogy, I can like explore that part of Scar Symmetry uh -huh. sound because the first part was like very melodic and progressive, yeah. like more than anything we've ever done. So this is like more of the Mel death metally. Like there's a lot of blast beats actually, mm -hmm. which we haven't had a lot of before. So so it's it's like more, actually more guitar bass. It's more riffings. So then I was like, four guitars. Maybe I should have like five guitars. Have one in the middle, <laughs> or maybe I should have six guitars. I have three on each side. <laughs> but then okay, I'll have three on each side and one in the middle. I'm so happy you came to the booth and uh, well, we see each other every other years. Yeah. And uh, well, I don't know where we'd be the next, but. Hopefully on stage. I, I want to see you play. Yeah. We'll see. <laughs> Bye. Thank wow. you.